Hello everybody, this is Stranger Gamer back for more Dinosaur King tournament stuff and yes, finally time for me to group all the competitors. And as you can see here, each of you has a number which I'll be referring to. And your numbers will be picked via the random number generator, the saviour of these tournaments. Right, so let's not dilly tally and let's get on with it. And before we start, I just want to explain how this will work. So I will pick a number and then and now whoever that number is we'll go into group B and then we'll go on to group C, D, E, F, G, H and then we'll start with A. So let's get started. So this next, this first combat will enter group B and that is number 17. Ooh, ooh group B for the house. Ooh that's, it, that's interesting one of the heavy hitters in group B already. <laughs> yes, I, I do apologise for the last one where the Dinosaur King was a little bit overpowering, but that's, that was me just playing around. Hopefully he's a lot better this time. I have to play it super serious. There, that should be better. Right, next up we have number 35. Going into Group C, that is Mr. Backpack. Okay, as for Group D, our first combatant in Group D is... Darius. Or Darius. Okay, as for Group D... Number 18. Ooh, that's, I feel like a few Primal Carmen. <laughs> Get it right eventually. All oh, right, Group F. Number thirty-eight. I think we've had that. Oh no, we haven't. Brenton. Uh, which group could be the group of death? I don't know. I don't know. There's always one group of death, isn't there? There's always any major tournament. There's always a group of death you want to avoid. I suppose it comes down to your team against matchups against other people, like that's when you decide a group of death. Engineer Gaming. Um, so, so far we've only really had Louse and Primal as a, more of the heavy hitters. Well, Louse especially, Primal more of a, um, a usual suspect, I should say. Okay, number two. Okay, that's got to be something. That's Danix. Oh. So interesting so far. Okay, now we get to the fun bit, so I will drop this. Uh, we don't need to drop it down to 32. But I'm going to anyway. Who will join me in group A? Number 29. Actually, I just do 29 and then minus 8. No, that's. Ooh, Con Temple will be going into group A. Welcome to the fun group, Sunshine. Okay, now who will join the former champ Laos in group B? Number 14. That is. Ooh, I might be a heavy hitter. 1, 2, 7, 12, 13. Ooh. Not good for Dino Nerd. As he will join Laos in Group D B. Right, as for Group C. Number 27. Okay, then we can go, we can go all the way to the bottom. Okay, so 30. 30, 30, 30. Ooh, we got Pilk. Pilk the Milk. Entering Group C. Right, as for Group D. Ooh, the tension, the tension! Oh, come on, RNG! Yeah. <laughs> Number 24. So we have 29. Six. Ooh, no peak! 
So he will be entering group B. Right, now for group E, we'll be joining Primal Carmen. One, two. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Ooh, Aladar. Aladar will be joining Primal Cartman. Right, now for group F. Sega. Oh, number 27, that should be easy. The very last guy, that, well, gal, I should say, Dinosaur Queen. The dinosaur Queen will be going into group F. Not Ultimate Dino Queen, Dinosaur Queen. This just to clarify some confusion if there's any. Okay, number 13. Ooh, that might be ultimate. I think. 1, 2, 3, 4, 8, 9, 10, 11. Oh, well, it is an ultimate. And speaking of queens, we have ultimate dino queen. And she will go into group G. But as for group H. We will enter group H. Number 25. Oh, good. Oh, good. That is mm, Dendrospus. Excited. Very excited. Um, yeah, interesting so far. We got. I don't, I don't know which group could be like the so called group of death because we've got all the heavy hitters, all the repeat offenders in, in different groups. So, it's open so far. Anyway, let's move on to the third. Let's move on to our third members of Group A. So, who will also be joining me in Group A? Number 21. Ooh, who is that? Who is that? That is. Four, three, three. Ooh! So, just like last time, Tor will be joining me in Group A. Ooh, we got a rematch. Ooh, it's gonna be a rematch. And I think Tor beat me last time, so I need to get some revenge. Okay, number 17. Three, and oh, Kick Green. Ooh, Kick Green will be joining the former champ, Louse. In Group B. Right, as for Group C, let's have a look. Number 8. Ooh, that's gonna be number eight. One. Ooh, the Skrill. The Skrill will be in group C, and group C looks pretty promising so far. Uh, okay, as for group D. Ooh, oh, I think we might have our group of death. Toka Nightmare will be joining Nopi in group D. Ooh, look at that. Wouldn't want to be Darius. Okay, as for Group E, who will be joining Cartman? Group One, two, three, four, eight, and ten, 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 that's, that looks so far to be a pretty decent group for Cartman. Okay, as for group F. Number 8. Okay, so 1, 2, 3, 5, 6, 7. Okay, we've got Blood Moon. Going into group F. Oh, ooh, ooh, oops, <laughs> the up a dinosaur game on. Okay, so drop that to 18. As for group G, group number one, that's easy, that's Cryo Nova. Cryo Nova will be going into group G. Ooh, that could be an interesting group. With Ultimate Dino Queen and Cryo Nova in there. Engineer Gaming got a pretty good team. Okay, as for group H, which looks pretty open so far, we have number three. That's Jonas Chu. Ooh, 
All right, now we are at the stage where it's time to group the bot team. How this will work is that there's well, there's seven of them, so not all of not all the groups will have a bot team. They'll go from group A to group G, and then group H will have an extra human player. Hmm. I was gonna do it randomly, so I have like a um, random number generator, then a random letter generator, and then see what happens. But nope, we're gonna do it like this. Alright, sorry guys, I was just, <laughs> just playing around with this one. Right, we shall start with group A. So, we will have... Ooh, Team Primal Carnage going into group A. Well, that's quite interesting. Alright, now for group B. Ooh, Team Europe going into group B. Okay, now for now for group C. Ooh, Team South America going into group C. Might be a good one. It's probably a good draw for group C. As for group D, um I I hope to see North America. Oh no, no, it's gonna be Team Africa. Ooh, right. Again, that's a very good draw for people in Group D. Because I think Poker and I think Nopi and I think these guys all have fire dinosaurs. So a very good draw for these three. Not a good draw for Team Africa. But you know, we don't care about the bot teams, do we? I mean, they're just there to give people wins. Okay, so, ooh, Team North America though. Team North America quite deadly with that Brontokins. And that deadliness will be going into Group E. Oh no, no. It, it, I, when I make the bot teams, I don't make them too powerful. You know, just so they don't go... Just so they don't win the tournament. I don't, no one wants a bot team to win, do we? But they're just there for fillings. Okay, so Group F. Okay, so this next one will go into Group F, and then whoever's left will go into Group G. Okay, so the Champions team will be going into Group F. And Team Asia will be going into Group G. Um, yeah, interesting groups. Now for Group H. We need an extra human player, so... That should be 17. Okay. Two, four. Okay, so 17 combatants, and it's number 13. So, number 13 will be going into group H. One, six, eight. Ooh, that's random guy 86 going into group H. No, not 98, 86. <laughs> right, now for group A. As we as we begin the closing stage of the group draw. Up first is number seven. One, two, three. Oh! <laughs> oh, it's gonna be a big one. Ultimate Dino King going into group A. Oof, that's a big group. That's a group of death. You've got me, you've got Tor, you've got Ultimate Dino King. Like, whoever's left, I'll have a, look, I'll have a quick look. What would be the worst draw for us? Like, in terms of heavy hit as well. Le Pope, maybe Le Pope. Uh, Chainsaw. I think Le Pope, Chainsaw, Melon. You know, regular competitors. Oh, that's a big draw. That's a big group group A. I think that's going to be the group of death. Anyway, do not. Number 11, that is... That is Shadow Force going into Group B, joining Laos. Oh, look at these two groups. Like, the odds are that one of us will probably have to play. Just as an FYI... The top four who qualify from this group will have to play four men teams from the qualify from this group, so look at the match 
I'm gonna look at the possible matchups that could happen. Like group A and B look very interesting. Like this a very good incentive for Laos to finish top. To avoid the possible heavy hitters of me, Tor, and Ultimate Dino you Never know, you never know. Might be they might be a spanner in the woods. Right, anyway, on to um Wait, is it? Yeah, there are 40. On to our next group C. Okay, number six. That is... Ooh, Star Pumpkin. Star Pumpkin is going to go into group C. Okay, now for group D. Ooh, number eight. One, two. Before. Ooh, finally. We got DBW's original gangsters. Ooh, yes. Might be a short exit. Might be a short tournament for him. Being drawn in with Nopi and Toka. Not quite the difficult group group deal. Right, now for group E, and that is number one. And that is Lanzu. So Lanzu will be going up, oh, damn it. Lanzu will be going into group E. Joining Primal Cartman and Alador and Nano Hunter. And Brontekins within Team North America. Right, now for group F. Number eight. Ooh, we've got Chainsaw. Chainsaw going into Group F. I think that might be a decent draw for him. Uh, group G. Group G, we have number two, Electric Boogaloo. No, it's Anton Gushan. Anton Gushan will join Ultimate Dino Queen and Ka and Cryo Nova. That was, what was it, Anton? Gushan. In Group G. Right now for Group H. Okay, that's number three. Hmm? Oh, we have Arctic Warriors. Arctic Warriors. Join in. Join in. Kind of the, the random guys in them. Um, group G. In H, sorry. Um, yeah, this looks a very open group, Group H. I mean, you have some heavy hitters in each of the other groups. You have Cartman here, you have Ultimate Queen and Crow, uh, Chainsaw, Toka, Nopi, and then Laos here. And then, and then obviously the heavy hitters all in Group A. Uh, group C looks kind of open as well, but Group H looks very open. Wouldn't want to call Group H. Right, on to our last groupings now. So, who we have left? We have Slifer Sky Dragon, Torvasaurus. Lepoke, Dark Ash Star, MEJP10, uh, Ibuki Suayaka, Chomp Stan, and Melon. So which one will be going into Group A? Number 6. So that is 8, 7. Ugh, not good for me. Because it's the all lightning team of. Ibuki Sayaka. <laughs> this is going to be a very tough group for me to negotiate. Two heavy hitters in Tor and Ultimate Dino King. Um, a relatively tough team for me um, in terms of Team Primal Carnage. And what kind of team does Connor Tampa? Oh yeah, this is going to be a very tough group to get out of. But honestly, like, I, I could actually be knocked out of the group stage, like looking at the group for me. That's a group of death. Especially for me. Like, all lightning dinosaurs. I think Ultimate has a uh, Tala Rubber. Um, I don't think Thor has an Earth dinosaur. But it, she has a secret. Um, yeah, it's, this is going to be a very difficult group for me to play. <laughs> uh, what is my Oh my god, look at the first match of the tournament. It's me against Ultimate Dino King. You can't make this up, can you? 
And then, who is it next? The tour against, I think. Ah, uh, go through them later. Anyway, group B. All I'm saying is I think I'm going to be out at the group stage. <laughs> Number one. Okay, that should be easy. That should be... Slifer Sky Dragon Triple X? Quadruple X. We'll be joining Lausp in Group B. Wow, Group B looks quite favourable for Lausp. And for, other than Lausp, I suspect this could be another open group. Um, Group C. Okay, oh, another number one. And that is, ooh, Torvasaurus. Now he did want to be drew, drawn against uh, certain people, so let's see if he got, in, got what he wanted. Oh, I think he got him. Um, oh, I think he got him um, Pelk. He wanted to draw against Pelk, so there you go, buddy. <laughs> I'm, I'm happy for you. Okay, now for Group D. It's quite a competitive group. Number four. Okay, that is... Ooh, I think it's Melon. Nope, it's Chomp Stan. We have Chomp Stan going into Group D. Um, yeah, Group D looks pretty interesting. You have T Toka and Nopi, probably the heavy hitters. But yeah, quite competitive elsewhere. Anyway, moving on to Group E. Number two. Okay, number two. Okay, none of these guns. Oh, okay. Dark Ash Star. The so Dark Ash Star will complete group B. Okay, now on to group F. Which is quite an open group, in my opinion. Okay, that's easy. That should be the bottom guy, which is... Ooh, it's Melon going into Group F. Making things a little bit more competitive. Her voice just went then. Right, now we're down to our last two competitors. Which is... Oh, I mean, who are... Emmy JP10 and LePunk. So who will join Ultimate Dino Queen? The answer is Emmy JP10. Emmy JP10. Join an ultimate Dino Queen and crown over in Group G. And, well, we don't need to do it, but as for Group H, the Pope will be going into Group H. Um, yeah, that's pretty... Okay, now let's actually have a look at the draw. Um, well, we'll start with uh, Group A, because honestly, this is the most... This is probably the group of death. You have three heavy hitters in myself, Tor, and Ultimate Dino King. And I wouldn't underestimate Connor Temple as well. Uh, what the, yes, the Spinosaurus with Dino Tech then. <laughs> the Giga's gonna give me problems. This could be a very difficult group for me to negotiate. But, other than the three heavy hitters, it's gonna be a tough group for these two to get out of as well. So yeah, that's a very competitive group, and well, look at the first match of the tournament. This is going to be me going up against Ultimate Dino Kick, and then Tor will take a crack at Ibuki, and Team Primal Carnage will go up against Connor Temp. As for Group B, well, we have the former champ Laos looking to regain his title after losing in the semis against me. A uh, Dino Nerd, Kick Green, Shadow Force, and Cypher Sky Dragon. All new competitors, so I honestly think Group B is very open. Except for Laos. I suspect Laos will get through. But as for the other spots, well, it's up for grabs. Uh, first matches will be Laos against Shadow Force, Kick Green against Cypher Sky Dragon, and Team Europe going up against Dino Nerd. Right, as for Group C. Which, yeah, I think I think Group C is another very open group. A lot of new players. I think Torvasaurus is, was in my last tournament. I'm not 100% sure. Pretty confident about his team. Let's find out. We have what, Mr. Backpack going up against Star Pumpkin. 
the Skrill against Torvosaurus, and Team South America against Elk. As for Group D, well, yeah, Nopi and Toka, um, both participated last time. Toka and, and they both got out the group last time, I think, and they both did pretty well. Anyway, as for our first background matchups in Group D, we have Darius against TBW's original gangsters, Toka Nightmare against Chompstan, and Team Africa against Nopi. As for Group E, you know, you've got to watch out for that Cartman, but other than that, another open group. And our first matchups in this group will be Primal Cartman going up against Lanzu, Nano Hunter against Dark Ash Star, and Team North America against Alador. Um, group F is, well, other than the last two draws, is was, ve was a very open at first, but the entrance of Chainsaw and Melon made things very interesting. So our first matchup would be Brenton against Chainsaw, Red Moon against Melon, and Champions Team against Dinosaur Queen 777. And speaking of Dinosaur Queen, we have Group G with Ultimate Dino Queen and Cryo Nova Iron Weight. Um, yeah, I suspect these two will probably get out of the group. And then, as for the other two, it's relatively up for grabs. So we have Engineer Gaiman against Anton Gushan, Cryo Nova against MEJP10, and Team Asia against Ultimate Dino Queen. And last but not least, the all human group, Group H. And honestly, probably the most open group in this tournament. I mean, I can see people who I think will get I think Lepoke might get out, but. And I think all, well, I think all of them have a chance to get out. And that's, that's true for all the other groups, but obviously that this one will be a lot, won't be as... There's not as many, well, there's not really any heavy hitters in Group H, so... It is up for grabs. And our first round matchups of Group H will be Danex Tactical against Arctic Warriors, Jonas Chu against Lepoke, and Random Guy 86 against Dendrosis. And that, my friends, is the groups for this tournament, and I look forward to getting them started, but I need a drink because my voice is going dry. So I hope you enjoyed this session, and I'll see you when the tournament begins. <laughs>